Good morning, afternoon, or evening, everyone. My name is Elavaris, and welcome back to the Battle for Wesnoth, specifically the Under the Burning Suns campaign. Last time we finished off the, the scuffle in the cave system against the trolls, and we are heading on to the next scenario. We did it pretty well overall. I think we lost someone important. Pathfinder, fighter, yeah, that's it. Really, just the Pathfinder and the fighter who were loyal, but yeah, hopefully we'll be uh, on the up and up. We got a lot of um, advancements, if I recall correctly, if I go back to the statistics panel. Um, we got a Thunder Guard, we got a Shied, our Sun Singer, our Sun Sylph, who, well, turned into a Sun Singer and then a Sun Sylph, then a Torok Vanguard. So, looking pretty good overall and getting ready to go into the next scenario here. So, let's do it. Chapter 6. The dwarf Grimnir led us through a maze of twisting passages, speaking scarcely a word. Finally, after what seemed like hours of marching, he stopped. He motioned us to be very quiet, and we, kept, we crept forward. All I could hear was the soft patter of feet and my heavy breathing. Even what little noise seemed to echo off the cramped walls of our rough-hewn passage, I was suddenly aware of the... wait... Even that little noise seemed to echo off the cramped walls of our rough-hewn passage. I was suddenly aware of the sheer mass of rock and earth above us, and for a moment, I despaired of ever seeing the sun again. Then I grabbed my sword with fresh determination, and vowed to see this mission through. This passage leads very close to the troll's main lair. Oh, I don't remember what voice I gave this guy. This passage leads very close to the troll's main lair. You can hear them tromping back and forth just past the eastern wall. All that separates us from the trolls is a thin wall of stone. I've had me boys mine that end of the tunnel with explosives. When you move a unit adjacent to the final wall, I'll blow the charges and open the way. The troll leader should only be lightly defended. He sent most of his big warriors to the front. You'll know the head troll when you see him. He's big, grey, and extra ugly. I thought that's what all the trolls looked like. I suppose we'll just try to find the one that shouts the loudest. So you dug these tunnels all by yourselves? Long ago, before the, the damn trolls invaded, we spent our days digging tunnels all through these mountains. Oh, the ore and precious stones we mined. The mines were filled with the joyful sound of dwarven hammer and dwarven song, and our jeweled halls glowed as brightly as the sun. Cumin and elf princes would pay us royally for the craftsmanship of our forges. But now the tunnels are silent, and we spend our days hunting down those accursed trolls. But there's no point dwelling on the past. There's more work to be done. Still, we have our honor, and I promise you, do this for us, and you will be rewarded handsomely. It shall be done. Kill the troll leader. Unfortunately, our money supply is... Uh, decaying a little bit as time goes on so we only have nine income not ideal who do we got here we should have Kenoth warrior he's loyal we're gonna rec recall him that's what we like Oh, you got like no HP. What the heck? Got 53 and you've got 70. And you've got plus 4. What? How does that even work? Because this is a Kenoth Sun Sylph and this is an Elf. Wait, what? I am confused. Uh, okay, that's a little odd. Well, this one out. Plus seven. You get the Thunder Guard. I mean, he's not that reliable is the problem. Well, whatever, we'll get him. I think we're going to get another Sylph, to be honest. Her out, resilient and dexterous. Very nice. And we're basically just going to go all loyal units, I think. Do 
Dwarvish Berserker. I don't know how useful he's really going to be. The Dust Devil. It would be good to get another level on this guy. We'll get him. I had another Dwarf, didn't I? Dwarvish Fighter. Going to want him in the caves. Screw it. We'll get the Champion. He's loyal. Might as well. It's only 20 gold. Get the Flanker. Okay. Let's do it. I will wait till next turn to do it, actually. Or early finish bonus. Once you are done moving your people into position, I will blow the charges. This is 60 turns. I'm probably going to need more turns. Fire in the hole! My work here is done. I must report back to me king. I have many more things to do before the day is done, but I will return once you finish your mission. Fight well. Intruders! Kill them! Oh, they're all level 2s, eh? Oh, okay, that's not a lot of them. So 21 1, 17 2. How far can you move? Get Vanguard here, they're in formation now. So we should have 50% defense. This is a little sketch, actually. I don't really like how packed we are in here. Oh boy. Okay, I think we're going to need to hold a bit of a choke here. Let's move out. I have a feeling what I want to do is actually hold. Like, I could do a three-on-one. The problem is I'm not going to be able to put a healer here because then I'll just get clapped by the troll. So I'm thinking the play is to do a 4v2 up here. We go here, we go here, and then we put a dwarf here. And we just have someone tanky here. And then we get shied there. We'll get another healer. And that'll be our play. Oh. Intriguing. Okay, let's get our shide spread out. You're two, you're two. You're going to go there. Interesting. Five, six, seven. Wow, that was really good. I'm surprised he got that. That hurt. That was risky, apparently. The 12 heal is crazy. That's so huge. It's a 13-4. We don't like we don't need a 13-4 in our life. Let's go for a 7-4. 12-4. Felisa. Very nice. So 24 to 648, no way she can kill. Who needs experience? I'd like to get this guy the kill if I can, actually. How would I get him that kill? 6-4. 6, 6 12, 18. We'll try. Very nice. Okay, and I'm actually... F this guy might die. He's got 50%. Not great. I don't want to attack with him. This guy could come in. 19-2. He could kill this guy, actually. I need to defend. 
you have 50% resistance to these attacks, right? 50%. So he's going to be doing 10-2 max, which is going to be put him at 16. And this guy's going to be doing like 5-2 max. I'm just going to put him at, yeah, he's okay. Let's do that then. Okay. Perfect. All according to plan. Oh. Who are they fighting? It's a good question. Okay. Big heals. Gave him a little bit of XP there. That's what we like. Now. Who's getting this kill? You. So two people can attack here. Highest percentage is that she doesn't die. He, she doesn't kill. Perfect. That's exactly what we wanted. Very nice. These big heals are also really nice. Big fan of this. You're getting plus zero. We're going to have to come in here and tighten that up a bit. He's not recruiting anything else, so... I think we're going to get ready to hold the line here. Let's see. If I move her back, they can both step up to here. They can do a lot of damage. 54, 55 don't really want to lose either of these guys. I'm going to put you up there. You there. Dust Devil? Is that a little dangerous? 50%, right? So this guy's going to be doing max. He's going to be doing 8. 8 and 16. This guy's probably going to be doing 10. So they need to hit all four times. I don't want to risk that fully, though. Now, they can only both hit this guy. 17, 17. He's 34. And the other guy's hitting 19. He's going to have 70%. It should be okay, I think. I think it should be okay. Now, healer, where are you at? There you go. Yeah, he'll be okay. Perfect. Yep, we're good. Okay, how are we doing this now? You're so close to leveling. So, we're going to go you to here with the 7 4. It's okay. There we go. HP if she hits all four times. Beauty, that's the kill for this guy. He's so close to leveling. We could give this kill to anyone. We give it to Clay. Give it to we'll give it to the Dust Devil. Very close to leveling now. That's what we like. All right, let's get out here. Need to finally start making our move. Just don't like the fact that this troll's right here. It's not great. She does a 12-4. Let's just do it. We'll trade some hits with him. Big heal over here. Actually, you're going to go there. We're going to bring you guys up forward. Nice. That's pretty big. Let's just hope you don't kill. Or hit like anything. Okay, I guess that works. 
One, two, three. Beautiful. One XP away. You'll love to see it. Here. And here. There we go. You can come down here. You can finally get moving. Let's go. Oh, King doesn't want to move, does he? Does not want to move! Well, got bad news for Bozo. Oof. Let's do it. Stronger Dust Devil? I mean, he doesn't need to be fully healed. Shouldn't have done that. He should be going up here. Getting these caps underway. Okay, so we handled that early phase very well. Not even close to... Well, okay, we were close to losing someone once due to some poor RNG, but... Okay. Let's see what we're doing over here. Oh, nope. 7-4. Okay. You only need a hit, like, just do that. <laughs> You'll love to see it. Archmage, that's huge. Who's getting this kill? Let's do it with Kalei, if we can. I gotta be safe. Nice. Alright, let's go on a search, see if there's anything around. Oh. Tell us where your leader is hiding. Never. Master, look. Oh, that was a weird uh, voice for him. Ha! You think you can save your friends? You are wrong. Og, go kill the other prisoner. We will deal with these fools. Yes, Master. I'll make him suffer. Ah! If we move fast, we might be able to save the other prisoner before he gets killed, too. Yeah, let's do it. With haste, men, forward. Yeah, we gotta go. We're gonna have to rush with the sylphs. Yeah, don't even care. I can't even die. Like... Let's go. Quick, quick, quick. Who can she attack? Just go after this guy. Okay, that wasn't ideal. But you can do that. And then you're going straight this way. I'm gonna make you squeal, dwarf. Yeah, we gotta go. Send you down this way. Whoa, this place is hot. This cavern's so hot it's stifling. I can already feel my armor's heating up. If we tarry here too long, we'll roast alive. I don't even want to think about what would happen if I tried to walk across the lava. On the other hand, the lava does light up the cavern nicely. I'm just thankful the trolls have constructed a bridge across the lava. They've broken the outer guard line. Destroy the bridge. They must not. Uh, oh. Ah, oh. uh, I take that back. Still, the trolls don't seem to be advancing. I guess they think the lava can hold us back. Well, we'll show them. It will take more than a little heat to stop us. Any unit that ends its turn on a lava hex, except those that can fly over it, will take 25 damage at the beginning of the next turn. This lava damage can kill units. Yeah. Oh, boy. 
Flying units will just take two damage per turn when flying over lava, though they too can die if they spend too much time over it. Also, because of the heat in the cavern, all units on the cave floor axis will take two damage to start of each turn. That's not nice. That's not great, I'll be honest. I think this is the time to recruit our next Sun Sylph. I have to be careful here. I wonder if this guy can get that kill. Probably not, but... Nice. Uh-oh. Arise! Arise and engulf the intruders in your holy fire. What the heck is that? It sure doesn't look good. Last thing we need in here is even more fire. Yeah, he is indeed correct about that. Oh, please, buddy. Just throw a spear at him. Yeah, he goes next. So hopefully that's fine. Who wants this kill? Let's do some damage. You want that kill, I'm pretty sure. Let's give it to Nim, though. 5-5. Five, five. Beauty. Just throw your spear at him, buddy, and please hit. Or else he's dead. I mean, if he lives or dies, it's just going to be down to luck at this point. Yep, he's dead. I go now to join my forefathers. Yeah, he was a brave warrior and a true ally who will be missed. Oh, well, there's nothing I could do about that. I rushed over there as fast as I could. It's the way the cookie crumbles, I guess. Nothing else I could do. So, sexy got hit like three times right away. Oh well, I guess. All right, well, the flying goon squad is who's gonna be responsible for this section here. So I wonder, like, oh, they can move pretty far on lava, actually, now that it looks like, oh, they can, oh, interesting, okay, 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 that's not that bad, then. 4, 3, 8, 2, fire breath. Okay, so we're gonna need to prepare a little for this little trek. She's a fire mage, she should be fine, right? be funny if she could just clap this guy at 50% fire resistance makes perfect sense 16-4 <laughs> that's disgusting guardian phoenix eh interesting so 25 damage could literally basically wipe any of the units I have pretty quickly if I leave him in there for two turns so gotta be careful flying unit goon squad will be pretty good here I wonder if there's any little like secret passages so who wants this kill I mean yeah 28-1. You can get a kill. Let's go for it. There we go. Okay. We need our big healers in here. It's going to be like crossing the desert sands again. I have a feeling there are going to be more than just one of those guys that comes out of the lava. A lot of healing icons, that's for sure. She's got six movement. It looks like the lava costs two. That's not great. She could go around. 
It looks like we need to go that way, really. We're gonna have to do that. You can just run straight there. Uh oh. Oh, that's really bad. Of course, of course that's what happens, ain't it? Well, I thought I recruited another one of these guys. Oh, frick, I left her over there like a monkey. But So she's going to need to go here. Perfect. 18. Disgusting. Okay, that's okay. He's only got five. We need to slowly move these the rest of these guys over. Okay. Clay can move there, but I need to move more safe with him. Yep. Oh, she only took 18? Oh, it's because she has fire resistance, isn't it? Yep, that's nice. Okay, so you're not doing great, buddy. You're doing okay, though. Let's go ahead and do that. You're gonna go in. Yeah, it's gonna be a little, little trek here, ain't it? You're gonna go here, you're gonna go here. Here, you're gonna go here. Send you over that way. Nim's gonna go in. Oh. Yep, that really hurts. You're up there. You're over there. Okay, nothing of interest so far. Something over there, maybe. Ooh. A pile of bones usually represents something important. You need to sit here and do big heels there. You're going to go over here. You're going to do a heal there. Kalei's going to come in. Going to get hit for a buttload. You can go in as well. Yep, that really freaking hurts. I want to send my strongest Sun Sylph over there. Interesting. You're doing okay. Dwarf's gonna go. Uh oh. They obviously weren't enough. You can go alert the others and summon reinforcements. I will hold them off as long as I can. May Grickna protect you. I'll be back soon. Uh oh. Don't like the sound of that. I'll kill him next turn. Unless he can do more if I just go for it. Pretty close to dead. 
You are going here. You are going here. Put her in the lava over there. That's okay. Or actually... I put her there. She's only taking six damage. You're going to need some help. He'll be okay. Oh. Hello. He suddenly got movement again. Not ideal. It's cooler here. There seems to be a draft to the west. Oh! Hail, friend. Ages ago, I too fought the trolls and came to this place. But by ill luck, I was burned to death by the lava and died nearby, unblessed and unhonored. Find my body and grant me the peace I so dearly wish for. Do this and I will let you pass. This looks like a troll crypt. Whoever it was must have been very important because they have their own undead guardian. Okay, so I'll just sit there. That's going to be this body right here then. So he kind of screwed himself, didn't he? Hey, Kalei, you wanted some XP, didn't you? Support. The upkeep costs of adjacent friendly units are lowered by one? This ne unit negates enemy zones of control around itself for allied units. Oh. The upkeep cost is very interesting. I feel like I want to go upkeep. Enemy zones of control. Hmm. See, but he's not going onto the front lines that often, so I think supporting is good. That's gonna another layer to think about. <coughs> okay. This guy's doing okay. He's gonna be hurting a little bit, but. send you up here actually then you're gonna go here and heal him yeah doesn't like that a lot of heat look a crumbling skeleton I think this might be the body of the dwarven ghost it shouldn't take long to dig a shallow grave May Alo, or whatever god you worship, grant you peace and safe passage to the afterlife. We will avenge your death. Thank you. You have done for me what all my dwarven kin never could. I will no longer block your way. I leave now for the halls of my ancestors. Oh. Crypt Guardian. Okay. Very cool. I'm going to finish getting through this cave and then probably call the episode. Uh-oh. Not a big fan of that. To the front! We must establish a perimeter. You need to get the hell off those tiles right now. You, my friend, are struggling just a little bit. Actually, okay. You are going to travel here with him. Okay, it's okay. Doesn't matter if you're there or not, but... Okay. 
There is a chasm here, cutting off the end of the crypt. It must be rather recent. The edges are still raw and crumbling. It cuts off the path leading to a rather ornate coffin. Intriguing. Very intriguing. Okay. Time to establish a defense. Hopefully Dust Devil should be okay. Looks like he kind of flies, so... You. Come in here. You're going there. You. See, ten twos. I mean, we could just do this. That solves that problem. So, there we go. Okay, dog going ballistic upstairs. That's what we like to see, but not really. You're there, you're there. Actually, I don't think I want that. We could use some more villages. That is for certain. There's one over there that I'm going to get in a second. For a troll, this is quite an ornate tomb. The coffin itself is quite impressive. Inside, the skeleton has crumbled to dust, and there are a few colored stones and trinkets. But what really sticks out is this emerald wand. I don't have much experience with magical items, but the asp with emerald eyes and large fangs carved around its shaft leave little doubt as to its power. We might find this useful before our journey is over. The wand fits comfortable in my hand. It doesn't seem to have much of a range, but in close combat it could be quite useful. Melee attacks dealing poison damage, eh? Interesting. Well, let's bring you over there in case she needs support. Because, like, something pops out of nowhere. Alright! We are over the 35-minute mark. This is where I'm going to call it for today. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. Been a fun little scenario so far. So, been really enjoying this. And, uh, yeah, a lot, they did a lot of creative stuff with it. So, I look forward to continuing to play so yeah thank you all for watching hope you guys enjoyed i'll be back next week as usual um with another episode so in the meantime i would like to thank you all for watching have a great rest of your day cheers guys